Welcome back to the channel guys, another crypto lightsaber YouTube video and I just wanted to let you know that if you did buy Math Wallet when I first brought it to your attention, you would have been up a whopping 160 plus percent even at the moment guys, Math is on a tear just like we said it would be in our previous video where we discussed about it, I believe it was just yesterday or the day before, all right, Math Wallet was up um was at 50 50 cents or right? up from around 30 cents over here it was around 40 cents okay it dropped to about 23 24 25 cents roughly okay and since then it's been climbing up and accumulating we've seen it break out of this resistance level and then break straight through this resistance level which would be the previous or uh, the previous high okay so it's in price discovery at the moment okay from about 50 cents it's up to about 61 cents 61.5 okay you would have been up if you did get in from my previous video around 24 25 percent as well all right guys math wallet is definitely looking really good it's performing exactly as i expected it would guys you know i was talking about math wallet down here as some of you will know all right um from speaking with them we ended up going into a bit of a a, a partnership on on one video just to let you guys know about the vpos mining and all that sort of stuff all right guys and um it was just a one-off sponsored video so they'll be paying me some math tokens for that which i will be holding for the long term all right guys but if you don't have any math token maybe you want to get some all right uh, especially now it's definitely uh looking really good you know it's in price discovery and i expect it to go a lot further okay look very big uh like a big pump there at the moment if you lower it you know you can see that it's not that big at the moment there's still a lot more that it can go all right, if we're looking from the bottom, from, from when this started, um, we're looking at around 220% overall. There's no reason why this can't go up a lot further. Maybe even double that, go up to about, you know, three, four, even 500%, okay? If you look at the market cap, it's currently at 67 million, all right? But it was Binance, the Binance Chain Wallet of the Year. I expect a lot of people to be getting into this, to be honest. Um, you can see the 24 hour low is 49 cents. Okay, so since yesterday, we've seen it come all the way up to 61 cents. All right, definitely performing amongst some of the other ones that aren't. All right, guys, um, you can get it on Uniswap as well, and you can get it on Bitmark, Balancer, and these two as well HBTC and BKEX. But yeah, Math Wallet is definitely looking really good, guys. Um, I'm impressed with it. All right, and um, you know, I definitely didn't make a mistake when I picked Math Wallet as a hidden gem. All right, guys, so put that on the radar. Not really anyone else talking about it, and you'll see that theme reoccurring on my channel, all right? I'm talking about the ones that no one else ain't, and these ones are bringing you some nice gains, all right, all right guys? So I hope you appreciate that. A uh, few other things I wanted to talk about was the fact that Binance has listed Sushi, okay? That's Sushi Swap, okay? Now, Sushi Swap is basically, um, it's just like another Uniswap, all right? Um, it says here that it's the evolution of Uniswap okay and you know i expect some hype to kick off around this one and um, just for the fact that you know um it's a new product everyone's really into uniswap right now the uniswap coins are really doing something uh, uh, great uh, but they are you know there's a lot of pump and dumps on uniswap all right guys so be careful with those obviously you got ones like dia that got onto qcoin you know and you'll see things begin to change with the price action once they do start to get on bigger and, and other exchanges you know, uh, but those, you know, the token swap exchanges, they're, you know, people like to use them. You know, I much prefer to trade on an exchange like Bitmart or Binance or Qcoin, all right? That's just my preference, all right? So don't sleep on this one because this one could pump. As you can see, when it got listed on Binance, it did go up a couple of hundred percent, I believe, but it's come back down, all right, guys? Now, question is, will this start to grow over time? Currently at $10.20, okay? And the market cap is around... 200 million okay 258 million at the moment so quite high it's 25 million coins okay so that's quite low as well so there's definitely room for them even at the moment but it's currently ranked 63 and 
from what I see in the groups and that, people are kind of getting a little bit hyped about this one. Another one that's getting a little bit of hype at the moment has also been listed on Binance recently is DFI.money, and that's another one of the YF coins, okay? It's actually just a hard fork of um, Yearn Finance, okay? And the former name of DeFi Money is YFII Finance, which is a fork of YFI project, okay? And um, yeah, this one's um, actually got a bit of a pump all the way up from about $153 a couple of days ago, all right? In fact, when I say a couple of days, more like two weeks ago, around, you know, the middle of August, okay? Now, on the 1st of September, it's currently 6,993, so about 7K, guys. All right. Um, now, if it was to follow the market cap or of of, uh, of of Yearn Finance, which went to a billion, you could see this potentially go up to 20k. All right. Although the total supply is a little bit higher than Yearn Finance. Now, one of the things that was attractive about Yearn Finance, which I didn't buy, by the way, was the fact that it's a new product. Everyone's going mad about yield farming at the moment. Okay. Yearn Finance went up to 38k, but the total supply was shared out equally. Okay. It was made available. That, so that anybody could become a whale, all right? That was the um, that was one of the aims of the founder. Okay, now we can't account for the 37 uh, YFI, YFI tokens that are missing, all right? Well, you know, it's only 37 tokens. Okay, but 30 30,000 tokens with a billion market cap, all right, guys? Um, yeah, obviously, hence the price. Okay, but it just made it possible for anyone to become a whale. There's no one, uh, no one was controlling the supply. The team didn't get 20% of the tokens. You know, early investors didn't grab 10% of the tokens. There was nothing like that, all right? It was made available for equal opportunities to buy Yearn Finance tokens. Obviously, we've seen the price go a bit mad, okay? Um, so yeah, with um, DFI.money or YFII, whatever you want to call it, guys, all right? Um, if it was previously known as YFI, they, uh, YFI, oh, they'll probably change the name soon. All right, but it's got a similar logo. All right, but it's not the same. Okay, it is a fork, so the same tokenomics, roughly. All right, like I said, total supply is a little bit higher. Okay, market cap is currently lower. All right, and the max supply is 40k. All right, guys, but as you can see, there's been a bit of a pump, and um, I do expect to pull back on this. All right, if we look at it on Binance. It's gone absolutely crazy since it was listed, all right? And um, yeah, in just a few hours, all right, 4, 8, 12, in just 12 hours, we've seen it go up, um, you know, um, you know, quite a large amount. All right, guys, so be careful with that. There's huge potential for it to continue up, all right? But I won't be farming into anything like that. But these yield farming tokens are definitely taking DeFi spot at the moment, you know what I mean? With, with, with things like Yearn Finance, taking bitcoin off the top spot not in terms of market cap but in terms of price action all right or you know it's it's, it's kind of crazy you know i think that's the first time we've seen a crypto hit that kind of price all right and it just goes to show the possibilities you can buy something like yearn finance for 1k and within a couple of weeks or a couple of months you know you can be you know made 40 times your money you're up to 40k and um you know i mean things like that will just bring a lot of newcomers in, into crypto all right guys we're here early the early bird catches the worm all right guys so we we just need to keep doing what we're doing i'm sure that you know we'll get that payday um too as well guys you know maybe one day we'll be in a token that will just go up to 40k per token and we've got hundred thousand of them you know who knows you know only time can tell what the future holds for cryptocurrencies but I definitely feel that cryptocurrency has most definitely secured its spot in our future, all right? Definitely, at least for our young children. I mean, the future is crypto, I personally believe. Um, everything's going to be tokenized eventually. And um, while we're on the subject of farming, uh, I'm not sure everything about it, okay? But Safe Haven has kind of entered the farming space, all right? Um, I'll put a picture on the screen just so you kind of know what I'm talking about. But they put an announcement out to say that they were launching a their SHA crypto farm, okay, at nine o'clock on September the fourth. All right, which means you can earn a twenty-four percent yield um, on your your safe haven tokens. All right. So you know, will that bring more buyers into the market? Okay. Obviously, we talked about safe haven in previous videos. We saw this bearish divergence. And now it's starting to play out okay safe haven is falling to the downside the rsi 
could really you know come all the way down here into oversold territory before we see a bounce the MACD on one day has got a bearish cross all right and momentum is shifting to the downside so i do expect there's a long way down for safe haven got the support lines drawn in okay for potential bounces got the golden pocket down here in the 0.618 between the 0.618 and the, and the 0.65 uh, and we've also got a uh, the, the 0.786 down here if we look at the fibonacci retracement i've got it memorized okay because i've done it so many times all right but yeah that's that's just the way my mind works sometimes all right guys you look at these charts enough and it kind of you know <laughs> you can just look at the chart and just see What's going on? What might be alien to somebody who's never looked at a chart or considered trading before? It's all it all makes sense through my eyes and in my mind. All right. So, and I'm not an expert, by the way. You know, I'm just like you guys. I'm just, you know, I'm self-taught. You know what I mean? No, no one is really self-taught, are they? You know, we all learn something from somewhere. Okay. When people say that you're smart, you should tell them, you know, everything I ever learned, I ever read somewhere, saw somewhere, or heard somewhere. Okay. So everybody's got the potential. So yeah, that's safe haven, all right. Just a quick update on that. All right, nothing really to say apart from the fact that I believe it's going down further. Okay, but yeah, still long-term potential in that. Definitely, obviously they're launching new products. They've got the farming now as well. Um, I would have to look into that to see whether it's the same, whether they're talking about the same thing, yield farming, okay? This is all new to me as it is new to everybody else. All right, guys, just like DeFi was new to me a few months ago, or earlier this year um, yield farming is something completely new to me don't know much about it do you know what i mean all i know is that you can earn a lot of money doing it you know all right guys if you're not subscribed to the channel please do subscribe leave a like and a comment down below and i'll see you guys in the next video